Hey guys, welcome back to more Guilds of Ravnica spoilers. You might hear a angry dog in the background because the dog hates me. So if it hears me, it likes to bark. So there it goes. Hopefully you don't have to hear it too, uh, too much. Alright, let's start with Hunted Witness. When white, for 1-1. One, one. Human, uh, the, when it dies, create a 1-1 one, one white creature token with lifelink. Uh, I mean, that's okay. Nothing spectacular I think it it's similar to um, yeah doom traveler but not as good doom traveler has flying and not lifelink but I mean I guess it's very uh, certain cases the lifelink will be better all right swift blade vindicator one red one white human soldier one one he's got double strike vigilance and trample I actually like this card a lot this is probably my favorite Boris card in this set so far uh, there, I mean there could be more but in fact I didn't even know this card existed till now or this guy actually a lot of these have, uh, these are getting to the newer stuff and um, this guy's actually pretty good I don't know what deck will use him but uh, I'm sure there'll be an aggro deck that would like just have some pump spells and he will swing in for a bunch then we have a foreign card. Uh, Detour. Three and a green. Sorcery. Search your library for up to two basic lands or gates. Put them into the battlefield tapped. This is real good for that gate deck. Keep talking about it. But they keep supporting it. Because this just ramps it so much. Uh, it's basically... Um, yeah, explosive vegetation. It gets pretty much exactly that. But it gets you gates. So, that's pretty good. It's, I mean, it's technically a strictly better uh, explosive vegetation, isn't it? It's not bad. Uh, Omni Spell Adept. Four and a blue for a three four. That's an awesome name for a card. Will it live up, live up to the hype? Uh, Human Wizard. Two and a blue. Tap. You may cast the instant or sorcery spell. I mean, I guess spell, yeah card from your hand without paying its mana cost. I feel that this card can be degenerate in some way. I don't know how or what card. Let me I'm gonna take a peek and see what they have to say. Uh come on. Apex of power. Okay. So that'd be interesting. Uh I figure that's what they would be recommending. Glaive of the Guild Pact. Two mana for a... I think one of the first three equipments I've seen. Uh, equipped creature gets plus one plus zero for each gate you control and has Vigilance and Menace. Equip three. Uh, these gates and their gatery. Alright. Uh, connive and content. I'm, I'm, I'm going to do this. This is much easier for me. Connive. Two. Uh, and then hybrid. Blue black. Blue black. Sorcery, gain control of target creature of power 2 or less. That's not too bad. Concoct, 3, a blue and a black. Surveil 3, then return a creature card from your graveyard to the battlefield. Uh, that's actually pretty good, actually. I like it. And, uh, I mean, both sides are actually not bad for, like, a control matchup. You can, pr well, I don't know. Control might not, mm, I don't know. It depends on the meta. That, that two power could be very impactful. Maybe. Ritual of Soot. Two and two black. Control all creatures with current mana cost three or less. I did not know this card existed. And I kind of like it. Um, it's real good against tokens, obviously. And uh, it costs four. So it's actually under costed for that ability, I believe. Let me see. Uh, yeah, that's the last time they had was Consume the Meek. And that cost it five, but that was a instant. So I guess that cost one more to make it instant. That's weird, but oh well. Watcher in the Mist, three and two blue. For a three, four spirit. It has flying, and when it enters the battlefield, it's Surveil 2. I like Surveil. Uh, he's real good and limited. Because he's got he's a decent body and he flies and he surveils so he's he's not bad 
I like him. I don't think he'll be doing anything anywhere else, though, but who knows. Uh, creeping Chill. Three in a black. Sorcery. Deals three damage to each opponent, and you, you gain three life. And it's when put into your graveyard from the library. Uh, wait, when put into your graveyard from your library, you may exile. If you do, three damage to each opponent, and you gain three life. So if you surveil this, you basically get to cast it for free, but you exile it. So that's not bad. I wish it scaled with the number of opponents with the gaining life, but I mean, I can't. You can't have it all. Personae Discordant. Three green and white. Uh, Leather creature dryad. One four. Leather creatures you control get plus one plus one. Uh, enter the battlefield. Create two one one white uh, soldier creatures that goes with life link. And at the beginning of your end step. Each player gains control of all creatures they control. Um, I like this card, but I don't know what I will do with it. Because it's actually pretty good, because you're getting... was it? You're getting 5 power for 5. And 2 of... Uh, you know, and 4 of that power has lifelink. And it's real good against, I guess, the consume... Uh, the conniving con uh, concoct deck, if that's a thing, because you get your stuff back. I don't know. Uh, it's not bad though. A foreign card, maximum velocity. Uh, one red, instant. Target creature gets plus one plus one till and haste until end of turn. Uh, eh. I mean, it's okay. And it's got jump start. Eh, if I didn't mention that, I don't know if I did. My brain just stops working sometimes. Uh, Demir Spybug. Blue and black. Instant. Uh, insect. Flying. Menace. Whenever you surveil, put a plus one plus one counter on Demir Spybug. And he's 1 1. Uh, I think this will actually be okay. Because that menace is going to help a lot. And there's going to be a lot of surveilling from what I've seen. So I think it's gonna be good. I recommend checking, like testing this guy out. Enhanced surveillance. One of blue. I actually know what this card is. Enchantment. You may look at additional two cards each time you surveil. Exile it, and you shuffle your graveyard into your library. This card is amazing. You might be wondering why is it amazing? Uh, let's just say. Um, let me find you a surveil card. I'm gonna just like this guy right here. It would make it so that he surveils four instead of two. The Watcher in the Mist. It just adds two, uh, two to it. Um, and I guess it stacks for each one. There is a real good uh, use of it with this already. And that is with... Uh, let's go back all the way... Where is he at? The Demon. Uh, Doom Whisperer. Uh, it'd be pay two, surveil four. That is real good. And, ugh, this card's, like, probably my favorite card in the set so far. Disinformation Campaign, one, a blue, and a black. Enchantment, interest bad field, you draw a card, and each opponent discards a card. That's pretty good. And when you reach the bell, you return it to his, uh, this card to its owner's hand. Uh, this card's actually pretty good. It obviously is going, like, you know, mix and match there. Um, but yes, yeah, enhanced surveillance is so good. I like it. Because it, it also gets you rid of, like, it screws over meal. And it also restarts your surveillance stuff if you deck yourself out. Ladev Guardian. Three and a white. Human Knight. Convoke. Two, four. Uh, not really useful anywhere, but. Uh, limited, really. You might run him in a knight deck if you don't have enough knights. But you should. And it should have something to do with this dock, like the wolves, but there's no wolves there. Lotlift Giant. Six and a black. Uh, zombie Giant, six five. Has an undergrowth. Uh, enters the battlefield. It deals one there to target opponent for each creature card in your graveyard. I have a feeling that that card can be broken in some way. 
I don't know how yet, but I feel it in my bones. Like, this card has potential somewhere. Well, as a finisher or something. I'm not sure of that. Had to see what else uh, comes out. Scion Fist Cyclops. One and two hybrid blue and red. Okay. He's a Cyclops Defender. Uh, as long as you cast the Insta or Sorcerer spell this turn, you can attack as though it didn't have the Defender. Um, he's okay, I guess. He's not that good, but... Limited, he'll be fine. But that's about it. What's the... Uh, three and a white. These weird spoilers that have the shadow in the corner. Uh, Parhelion, Patrol, three and a white. Flying, Vigilance, Mentor... Human Knight, 2-3. I'm not a fan of Mentor, so yeah, because it only, it's only going to help with like 1-1s one and one like 1-2s. One it's trash, though. I don't like that ability. Uh, I mean, I would actually like to be proven wrong on Mentor. I really do. Or maybe like they haven't shown the best Mentor ability. I don't know yet. Loxodon, Restore. Four and two white has convoke. When it enters battlefield, you gain four life. He's a three four. Um, I mean, he's okay. He's real good in limited, but ever everywhere else, I don't know about. And I guess if you're playing a elephant tribal, you probably need him because we have that many of them. Book devourer five and red is a beast. Is four five. Trample. Whenever you deal with comment and a player, you may discard all the cards in your hand if you do draw that many cards. Uh, he's kind of like a reverse shocker, I think. Uh, I guess Dragon Mage. I don't know what. For some reason, I was thinking. I was thinking Shocker. But. I don't know. He's, he's okay. I feel like there's some way to break this guy. I just don't know how. Um, and that will be it for this video, and I'm hoping you guys are enjoying my videos, because, I mean, otherwise it would be real disappointing, but, uh, I'm getting real close to the current stuff, like, literally days away, and by then I will actually be able to do legit spoilers, like, up to, uh, date, daily spoilers just you know do multiple spoilers a day all right but till then i'm hoping you enjoy my random videos and sorry if i seem out of it it's pretty late i just want to get these done because tomorrow is well it's gonna be monday uh it's technically monday now but you know i, I just want to say tomorrow Alright, thanks for watching and have a fantastic day. Peace out.